Hi friends, my name is Karen. Welcome to the room. Today we are reacting to season one, episode nine of Star vs. the Forces of Evil, Freeze Day and Royal Pain. Now in the last episode at the end, this guy came, what was his name? Moggy, Muzzy, M Mookie, Sassy, the guy. <laughs> Um, if you do like these reactions, you can see them fully uncut over on Patreon like a week early. And there's a Patreon exclusive over there too. It's The Leftovers. We're almost done with season one. It's a really, it's a really good show, you guys. Me in the morning. It's kind of our thing. You know what? I had that once. I had that once, like <laughs> in sophomore, was it sophomore year, or junior year. No, it was junior year. Yes. So in junior year, I had this class that was like the first room in this particular hallway. And when you walked out of the hallway, you passed by a water fountain, and of course there was like a ramp coming down from the other side, and I knew at a certain time at like 11.25 every day, if I walk out of, when I walk out of this classroom, when I walk past this water fountain, here comes my crush from the other direction. He always comes this way and he turns and walks out the door right here. And every day this happened and I knew I would see him at this point every day and it was something I looked forward to. Yeah. Wait, a nod? You don't even say hi? I'm working up to that. See, it's all a part of my 23-step plan. I'm already on step four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Easy peasy time, Freeze. Do you know what you just did? I can't deny that I go into a restaurant and make myself something. Better get into optimal nod position. <sighs> Ready. Or maybe now's the time to move on to the next step of your crazy plan. Which is what? You could talk to her. Okay, magic instruction book. Instruct me. Oh no, Glosseric is frozen too. Good. I never liked that guy. Scrape the sides, buddy. Okay, let's see, let's see. What to do if you make a dimension explode? What to do if you delete gravity? <gasps> Whoa. Looks like a giant hamster wheel. Now, how do we start this thing? Hmm. Well. I got this. <laughs> Father time? So, you must push this thing. Yeah. I love that Marco's I'm stuck in this here. giant, and now, giant and gap and he can't get his foot here. out. <laughs> and how long were you on the wheel? Oh, where has this been all of my life? Uh, look, look, look! You can play with mud on your wheel! Huh? Huh? Wow, that is an enticing offer, but... Nah. Uh, oh, there's some mud that's slightly different color. And, and there's a twig, and there's a bush, and uh, I don't know what that thing is, but it's waddling. <laughs> Wait! You can't just leave time stopped! Oh, oh, oh. oh my heart! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> This place must keep track of everything we've done in our lives. It's just him nodding at her over and over. Wow. I've been nodding for a long time. Hey, guys! Isn't this place incredible? It's great. Get it's back like on the wheel. In the future. The father time! Emerald Snake Strike! Great. I think we got him. 
probably can't just make him. Maybe there's some other way to turn that giant wheel. A hamster, a time Are hamster. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Actually, I was thinking we'd... Never mind, it works. Now you can go anywhere you want. <laughs> That's literally how I still feel. That's literally how I feel as an adult. If you have the time, why waste it? Looks like I'm finally getting somewhere. Uh oh. Uh. Uh. I really don't like his parents. Their characters are very, very annoying. I don't like them at all. Without actually getting away. If my parents found out I've been using magic for stuff like this, how about that? This was cool, but next time, maybe a little heads up? <laughs> Nothing! I just left a garment or two laying around. I thought perhaps I could stay here for a day while this blows over. Of course you can stay here. You are familiar. You can watch the kids while me and the wifey actually get away. Hasta mañana. Uh, what is the appropriate way to be using her wand here on Earth with no magic? Puppies. This visit is actually gonna be fun then. No. Magnificent. If you like this, let me show you the most magical room in the whole house. The bathroom! <laughs> what a glorious throne! Why does it have a hole? Um, humans put things in there. <laughs> this? I don't see why not. Oh, star. This? Go for it. No, star, you're encouraging bad behavior. What are they doing in there? Your father's bad behavior. There's one thing we got better on, Mimi. Tally! <laughs> How's that for getting it into the hole? <laughs> What's that? That's the candy castle. The why did there her parents? Why did her parents send her to Earth when they know absolutely nothing about Earth? Because I was under the impression that they'd been to Earth, that they knew stuff about Earth, and they were like, "This is where our daughter needs to go because Earth is a nice, safe place for her to." you know, mature and learn about stuff, but they don't know anything about Earth. So why is she here? Weebler Elf Clan, you sly dog! Gross, 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 gross! Absolutely not. What was that? Good morning, Star. Ba, 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 ba. It was ridiculously loud last night. It wasn't me, Oscar. It was my dad. He's insane! He just thinks he can come down to Earth and do whatever he wants. He is so inconsiderate. These people are not welcome here. <laughs> Don't wake him up, man. We'll see if Salivary recovers from this one. <laughs> I really need to talk to you right now. Hey, guys! Well, here I am. Yeah, now the party can start. I'm already going into orbit around him. Oh, no, 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 please, somebody. His gravitational pull is you. So, why don't you just kick him out, along with everyone else? No way. I'm not talking to that tool. <sighs> uh, hey, guys, are those water blue? Whoa. Fun, uh, fun. I don't ask for much. Just a pair of dry socks, that's all. It's like I'm mushing bananas between my toes. Marco, I am so sorry that every time I tried to have some fun, I ended up soaking your socks. <laughs> it's time to purge this party! Oh, no, no. Hey, two pairs of wet socks. I'm out of here. <laughs> um, sweetheart? I perhaps got a little carried away. And I may have been a little inconsiderate. I guess that's why your mother threw me out in the first place. I'm sorry, you guys. And you'll patch things up with Mom? Definitely. Um, 
Thanks. But a surprise is good every once in a while. Wouldn't you agree? Ah! <laughs> it's nice to see that there's a tiny bit of character development with Sar because she's like, oh, maybe sometimes the choices I make affect other people. <laughs> and I should take that into consideration before I like put water, water parks in the middle of the house. Again, I apologize for these episodes being late, but there's a lot, a lot going on with me right now. Um, thank you guys so much for watching and being patient, and I will talk to you guys later. That's all for now. I'll talk to you guys later. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, bye.